Hi guys, Ritzy here. Um, today I'm going to be doing a couple of uh, overdue snack crates. Um, here I have April's crate. Um, <laughs> I've just been very demotivated in doing these. And I have April, uh, May, and June to open. Um, so we're going to do that right now. Um, I have my pair of scissors if I need to cut anything open. Um, I have water to drink uh, in between the snacks because some of them are very dry. But we're going to open this. So let's see what April has in store. So the country of choice for April is the Netherlands. That's pretty cool. Um, and here's the box. Looks like two kinds of chips right away there, which is cool. Um, awesome. I do like chips a lot. Let's open the book. Um, I know I don't normally read in the book before I start, but I want to now. It, it feels kind of weird to do it without having done it in the prior videos, but I want to read a little bit about the country. Um, the Netherlands is a country known for its stunning natural beauty, rich historical significance, and thriving cultural scene. Explore the country's borders and be captivated by its gorgeous landscapes, iconic windmills, and delicious cuisine is among the best in, in the world. Cool. The population is 17.53 million. The capital is Amsterdam. The area is 16,158 miles squared. I think that's how you say it. Um, and language is Dutch. Okay, so let's see here. Look, we got some Lay's chips. Got some paprika flavored Lay's. Lay's paprika. Super bold and flavorful. These are a spicy spin on the classic Lay's chip. Well, that's kind of neat. Um, I do like paprika on like uh, deviled eggs. And stuff, so how about we try this? I know that my mic is going to capture all this crunching and everything. Ooh. All those smell good. Ooh, because my sinus is a little wake up. Wow, yeah, those smell good. This is honestly the first thing I've eaten today, and it's noon, so... This is technically my lunch right here. <laughs> hmm. Wow. That's really good. It's not like a bam flavor paprika. It's really soft. Or su su subtle is the word I'm thinking of, probably, but this is good. Mmm. Very yummy. Mmm. Wow. Really good. Okay, so, <coughs> oh, excuse me, <clears throat> that's the paprika flavor lays. Pretty good. <clears throat> I think I'll give those a 8 out of 10. Okay, next, um, uh, Thai, Thai curry chips from, uh, Crokey. Crocky, how do we say that uh, brand name? Um, 
These curry flavored chips are slightly spicy, slightly sweet, and a whole lot of delicious. Okay, cool. I've never actually had curry before. Um, it's something that I do want to try really bad. So let's open these up. Ooh, wow. That is a very interesting flavor. The smell. Hmm. There's honestly not very many chips in the bag. Of course, that's, that's, that's how they get you. You feel it halfway over the air. Let's try. Oh, it just looks like a ridged potato chip, but curry flavor. Let's try this. Interesting. It's very smooth. It's not too spicy. And I think the sweetness is kind of helping with that. Hmm. Pretty good. Another one. Hmm. Okay. Those are pretty good. I would say probably 7 out of 10. They're not as, like, delectable as the Lay's to me, but they're still pretty good. I'll probably let my partner try some of these when he gets home from work. He gets home early today because it's Saturday. Um, okay, next thing is... Oh, we got some chocolate stuff in here now. Um, Stroop. Stroop waffles? Well, that's cool. Two toasted chocolate waffles filled with caramel, cinnamon, and real bourbon vanilla. Warm it up on your cup. Oh, I guess you have these with, like, coffee or something. That's cool. Uh, chocolate stroop waffles. The, fa the world-famous stroop waffle, but in a specially imported coated chocolate flavor you can't find in the States. Yeah, enjoy with your morning coffee. Oh, that's cool. Darn it, I should have made some hot chocolate before this. Oh, well. Oh, I might need my... Yeah. I need my scissors for this. I need my tiny scissors. Yeah. Okay, I can tear that. Ah, get off me, so there's... Okay. Oh! <laughs> Looks like it kind of melted a little bit. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, and there's the caramel. Oh, my gosh. Oh! -ho -ho. Wow. Oh, that smells heavenly. Wow. Okay, I'm going to cut this a little more. I can really get at them. Oh my goodness. What, this smells so good. Uh, like, take me to the Netherlands right now and give me this. I will eat it. With, with or without coffee. I'm not a coffee person. I would much rather have hot chocolate. I'm not a coffee or tea drinker at all. I don't like them. I, I have drank coffee in the past, but that was just to get me by in church when I went to church with someone I was living with. Wow. Okay, so they're kind of like, it's like two stuck together. Wow, it's huge. That's, wow, it looks so good. Wow. I'm just marveling at this stroop waffle it's giant oh my god let's let's try this oh god i can smell it it's so good mm. Mm. oh my god mm. 
Mm. It's so chewy. Mm. Wow. That <clears throat> a little bit of bourbon in there. Perfect. Like that's a flavor I never knew I needed in like some kind of sweet. Wow. Mm. I'm definitely gonna eat this, like the whole thing with some hot chocolate. Mmm. That's so good. Mm-hmm. That is amazing. I need some water. Wow. Man. That's some good stuff. Um, next we have, um, it's like a piece of gingerbread. Oh, that's cool. Um, Pagenberg gingerbread. Spread some butter on this soft, light gingerbread for a traditional Dutch snack. Oh. Huh. Never heard of spreading butter on gingerbread. It's so cute. It's like a tiny little piece of bread. It's kind of soft. Mm. Oh, I do love the smell of gingerbread, though. It smells so good. Yum. Oh, wow. I thought it would be kind of stiff, but... No, it's just a little bit, but wow, that smells so good. Mm. Oh. Like, I've had gingerbread before where the ginger flavor is so overpowering, but this, this is really a not too overpowering. It's almost subtle. But it's still really good. Mm, wow. And it's got like that like 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 subtle spice of ginger. But again, it's not overpowering like gingerbread from America is. Like that that stuff is like hot on your tongue taste, but this is really good. I wonder who would pair with hot chocolate. <laughs> I'll probably have some hot chocolate later and like eat the couple things with hot chocolate because I'm weird like that. Mm. Last but not least, we have some candy. Looks like five pieces of candy. They're really cute. Oh my gosh. Um. Coffee candy. They're very cute. Aww. They're really cute little candies. Um, but these are uh uh hop hop just coffee. Originating in the 18th century, these hard candies are flavored with coffee and slight hints of caramel. Oh, that's neat. Wow, oh, cool. I like that. I'm not sure how I'm going to like these because they're coffee. I might give them to my partner. But try one for the video. That's how it works. I like the wrapping job on them, though. It's very nice. Just little candy boy. No slight breeze to it. It's kind of cool. Yeah, honestly, it looks like chocolate, but it's coffee, apparently. Ooh. Yeah, that definitely tastes like coffee. Wow. Ooh. I wonder how one of these would taste in some hot chocolate. I'm just a hot chocolate kind of guy, you know? Like, I like hot chocolate more than any other, like, hot drink. Mmm, well. 
Mm. Well, I'm going to suck on this candy. Um, but this was this uh, snack crate from the Netherlands. Thank you for joining me. Um, as always, um, I am not being paid for this. I bought a year subscription with my own money. Um, and all of my reviews of the food and the crate itself are my own opinion, whether that's good or bad. Um, as you guys know from my previous videos, I am very upfront about how I feel about products. Um, and my favorite thing in the box is the strip waffle, like, give me 10 of these. Uh, it, it's so good like I really can't wait to have this and the gingerbread with some hot chocolate like after this I'm going straight to the kitchen and making myself some hot chocolate like it's so good the candy though the candy is a bit much for me though I am gonna finish it I'm gonna finish sucking on it because like I don't I don't like to waste food but <clears throat> it's good. Um, these chips were pretty cool. Um, like I said, I'll probably let my partner taste the curry ones. He might like those, but I'll definitely eat these paprika ones probably while I'm editing this video. Thank you for watching. Bye.